I had to do my makeup first, y'all, because I was looking crazy. I think my cycle is about to start, and my stomach was hurting this morning, and it was just a mess. If you guys want to see my outfit, I did post um, a picture on Instagram at I am Sharika B. So if y'all not following me like sis, go follow. Okay. But y'all, I did go pick up. Well, I didn't pick it up. I ordered a new tripod. I'm really excited. Tony showed me how to work it a little bit yesterday. But um, I still got to play with it some more. But today I'm here to show you guys my favorite shades because I get so many questions about where I get my shades from, so many compliments, and I get a lot of you guys inboxing me asking me to do a video on my favorite shades. Now, if you don't know by now, I get all of my shades from Amazon. Of course, I'll have the link in the description box. Now, this is the style that I typically go with, uh, which is the aviator style. I'm out of breath. <sighs> I need a little bit. I have this um, particular style in five different colors. So this is the black and they're really cute. The black ones, they're really pretty. They're really lightweight. And I always get all of my shades um, oversized because I have like a chubby face. So smaller shades don't look good on me. Um, these are the gold ones. And I hope you guys can see them. They probably all look the same to y'all. <laughs> yeah, so this is the gold. I don't know what's been up with my neck looking so freaking shiny. My neck looks so shiny, but yeah. So this is the gold pair. I like these. And y'all know my favorite ones because I wear them all the time, the silver. These are my favorite ones. Can y'all see that? silver I have them in pink and blue I really don't wear these that much and I need to clean these I thought I cleaned them pretty good but this is the pink and blue ones they're really cute but I don't wear these too much um just because like I said I like my silver and my gold one so I'm always reaching for those but these are still cute but the other two like I wear those in the winter and the summertime these these are more like spring summertime shades you know so um they cute though girl I need to wear these more um and then these these are probably like the first pair that I ever bought when I start wearing this style so I have bought these same ones probably like three different times because they were getting scratched up I really like these a lot they're so cute <laughs> I actually have two pair Here's my old pair because they're scratched up. They're like scratched up right there. Y'all probably can't see it, but yeah, they're scratched up. So, and here's another pair of the silver ones. They're scratched up too. So I got to throw them out. But I was going through my shade um, box and I said, well, you know what? Let me just go ahead and knock this video out the way and toss out what I don't want. I'm going to get, um, I'm going to start a Poshmark. Y'all excuse the people because during this time, it's like 12, 14. During this time, they're doing a lot of um, landscaping and stuff like that. And they do it like every single day. Like, I don't understand it, but they do it every day. So, yeah. These are the light brown ones. Now, this is uh, one of my newest purchases. These. Now, these things are big. So, if you guys order these, make sure that you like large shades because they are oversized if you have a small face these are not for you because they will swallow your face okay but these are so cute so sleek like make you feel like gang 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 <laughs> yeah these are like so cute i really like them but they kind of smush my nose a little bit but they're like so cute okay next these i really like these too i really like either the flat tops or the aviators are always like my go-to shades like i really really love these they're so cute they have like the tortoise at the top and then blue at the bottom they're so cute 
all of these shades were like under $20. So um, they're very affordable. They're doing the most. It sounds like they're getting close. They're doing the most. But I do have a lot of shades that I don't wear that I was thinking about putting on my Poshmark. I need to go do my stuff. Start my Poshmark up. Um, I'm gonna show you guys a couple. I have like two pairs that everybody love these shades, but I don't really wear them that much. So I'll be back. Yeah, I low key feel like I should have just did like a sunglass haul on all my shades because I have so many. But oh <laughs> God, I have a lot. But these will be going up on my Poshmark. I think these are like Gucci inspired. They just don't look good on me. I don't know. They're like, they're too small or something on my face. So I don't know, but I see a lot of people on Instagram wearing these or they used to wear them. They're a little old now. Um, but I think, I wanna say these are Gucci inspired. I'm not too sure. I purchased mine from, um, I didn't get these from Amazon. I got mine from, um, it wasn't Amazon, but honey, you can get them on Poshmark, okay? I have to make my Poshmark today, but that's where you can get them from, sis, from me, okay? <laughs> if you like them. Um, and then these, I definitely know that these are Gucci inspired. These right here, but they don't, they just don't look cute on me, I don't know. And I love them, but it's just like, I don't know. They don't look cute on me. So, if you liking them, sis, and you over there gagging, honey, Poshmark. <laughs> and then, I don't know, how many pairs did I bring up here? I thought I brought three pairs up here. Oh, and then these right here. These remind me a lot of my Gucci's that I have. These are my Gucci shades right here. Y'all can't have these. These are like the most expensive shades I ever bought. And I was so pissed off after I bought them because then I was seeing them all over um, Instagram, like the bootleg ones, not the bootleg ones, but the ones that's not name brand exactly like this. And I was so pissed. So this was the last pair of expensive shades that I ever bought. Cause after I saw that, I'm like, never again. I would never spend $300 on a pair of shades. I'll wait until somebody come out with a replica, okay? But this is how they look. And I actually, oh, I need to clean them. I actually purchased these from a YouTuber. Um, she changed her name so much. I am Fash. Y'all know who I'm talking about? She has um, a sunglass line. I love her so much and I purchased these shades for like $40. But I don't really wear them as much. But I do like these. I don't know, y'all might, y'all can't get these. Y'all like these, y'all can't get these. So, um, yeah, I'm gonna keep those. These are my Gucci ones. $300, $40. Y'all know that's ridiculous. Okay, yeah. These are old, it doesn't say Gucci over there. I don't know, I haven't broke these out in so long. The only Gucci's that I have and the only Gucci's I ever have because I would never spend that amount of money on shades again, okay? Never. Unless it's for Tony or something, because he don't wear, um, he only wear designer shades. And, you know, girls, we can wear stuff that's not designer. It doesn't really matter to us. Well, it doesn't really matter to me. Everything I wear doesn't have to be name brand. I don't care about all of that. So, but yeah, so that's the shades, y'all. So, y'all let me know which ones you guys like. I'm about to um, change. I have to run up to Tony's school to, um, pick up his report card and I gotta put all these shades up. Y'all gonna come over here and help me. I gotta pick up um, his report card and then I have to run to the store. I don't have to do a mukbang today, thank the Lord. So I'm gonna take full advantage of this day and make sure that I eat something clean and healthy. Um, Cause Tony did a mukbang all by himself. If you guys have not watched that video yet, go ahead and check it out. I was so proud of him for doing it. He was a little nervous, but I think he did a really good job. 
um and then i just want him to get in the habit of doing them by himself so that way i can have um a break <laughs> because you know they these are so cute y'all but um you know he can tony can really eat he can eat a lot and he eat a lot of um things that i don't eat so he eats steak and ribs and stuff like that so i think it'll be fun for him to get in there and do one by himself every now and then so we'll see we'll see if you guys like it but um so yeah so let's just enjoy the rest of the vlog okay y'all so now that i'm changed to something a little more comfortable you know this is just like basically how i look all the time with a t-shirt and some shorts or something some slides you know so um let me get out of here tony you ready let me sit y'all down he not even listening to me let me check my instagram he ain't listening I gotta catch up on my comments and I'll, let me know in the comments if you guys have started watching um, Stranger Things because I loved the first one but everybody's saying like the second one is like the best one yet so I wanna try to catch up on that. Me and Tony did watch I think like the first episode but then we ended up falling asleep. So you know sometimes like the first episode can be a little slow. So y'all let me know if y'all um, have watched that show already because I'll be watching it today. I am getting stuff done today. I was thinking like I was saying well you know what I can go ahead and um, do a mukbang for tomorrow. You know just to get ahead of the ball. So I can do like a little, since I have my makeup and stuff done already, I don't have to worry about it later. What y'all think? Should I do that or should I just chill? Take the rest of the day to chill? Mm. I don't know. I might go ahead and just knock out a video for tomorrow. <sighs> we'll see. Let me go get this daggum boy. Yeah, I told it was in there asleep the whole time. I'm calling his name. But I have to stop to the... Uh, to the ATM because Tony lost two of the school books so they won't give you your report card if you have like books that haven't been turned in and we looked everywhere for those books he probably left it at school or left it in extended day or something like that and now I have to pay for it I have no idea how much these books even cost um I'm gonna just take some money up there so um, how much y'all think they cost? So I'll probably just take like $40 out of the ATM, which they probably, hopefully they're not that much. Maybe they're only like $8 books or something like that. So, um, but I'll just take $40 out just to be safe. So do that. Then we're going to the store. I might go in, um. I might go um, to Home Goods because I think they restock on Thursdays, and I didn't go in there last Thursday. So, see if they have anything new. And I need to get me some new sheets because the sheets that I have are like so rough. I need to get new pillows too, but I don't know if I'm gonna do that today because I really don't feel like it. Because I'm pretty moody, so that's also a clear sign that you know my auntie's here. coming to the drive through ATM sometimes because it's like you never know somebody might try to do something crazy I don't like coming to the drive through uh, ATM by myself and then this one is in like the back of the bank so it's like I'm 
constantly looking around. And my stomach hurts. They gotta send me the budget. Hey, when y'all in the car, y'all vibing to a song and people looking at you, y'all stop because I don't. I'm a, a. <laughs> I damn sure don't stop. I keep doing my thing. Like, what y'all in my car for? These two guys was just like all in my car. I'm... And you better be glad it wasn't a ratchet song because I be eh. <laughs> walking like a dog, walking like. <laughs> Look at the frog legs, y'all. Okay, y'all, so I made it back home. So I picked up, y'all saw this already, but two bags of crawfish and six clusters. They're nice size ones too. I paid 36 bucks. I think the crawfish is like $6.99 a bag. And then I bought um, two of the small lobster tails for $10. So um, I've decided I'm gonna go ahead and do a mukbang. I'm gonna just do some crab legs. I'll probably do well, I will do crawfish later on this week. I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Love y'all.